I think in every case, with people, if there are people who are trying to be obedient to God, I believe you are going to receive very tough resistance. Your mother, father, boss, co-worker, or whatever may come against you. You may begin having financial problems. Many uncomfortable things may begin to happen to you, but be determined and stay that way in trying to be obedient to God for myself. And I don't know if this is true for other people. I guess on average, I get attacked by demonic stuff, I believe. But there are times, if I am saying this correctly, where the attacks increase and may stay that way for, man, a week or more. But if I stay firm in, in the things of God, not giving up on the things of God, after a while, it calms down. So meaning the, as it seems, the attacks decrease. So I guess I can say weather the storm. Get through the storm. I believe as you increase in God, I think that there is automatically going to I believe you are going to receive higher attacks as you increase. But I believe maybe for everyone, at least for me, I think there are times when things seem out of hand. When times get really wild, I guess I can say, stay firm in God. Don't be like, don't be so overwhelmed to where you give up on God and try to solve the problems without God. If you understand what I am trying to tell you. So if you are trying or if you begin trying to live for God, Expect very strong resistance. Expect problems from people. Expect things to go wrong in your life because I believe it is going to happen. I am not trying to place a curse on anyone, but I believe from at least maybe two or more of the people that I helped or am helping, I think that is happening to them now. There is a woman I used to help so much and I believe she decided to live for God. And that woman would go through so much problems. I was amazed. So much problems. With me, I guess, <laughs> I have gone through so much problems that I guess it seems like a usual thing, you know. But I guess to hear another person going through this and going through that, I guess to me it seemed shocking. So, if you are trying to be obedient to God, I believe, or if you begin trying to be obedient to God, expect bad things to happen. Yes, I believe you should pray about it, but don't see it. Don't see it as strange. Don't see it as unusual, I guess I can say. I believe demons are trying to get you back into sin. For instance, if 
if I was a demon, which I probably should not say, <laughs> I believe demons want people to go to hell. So if you are doing something, if you are doing something, trying to avoid hell, and if a demon is trying to place you in hell, what do you believe a demon is going to do? Do something to where, what? To where you will give up on God or do something to where you are not working the principles of God, right? So don't think it strange if bad things happen to you in, in life. Yes, you can pray about it. Yes, fast. I believe you can pray about it. If you can, pray about it fast. Do what you have to to get over what you are going through. So in my experiences, the increased attacks are temporary. But I believe there is a certain level of attacks that you may have to go through for the rest of your life. This is one of the reasons I believe, I think living a life pleasing to God is not all the way easy, but it is extremely worth it. I think there are so many incentives to living for God. So many. Read your Bible. Let me stop here. God bless you.